Hello and welcome back. My name is The Final Rune and this is my official, official Let's Play video. I'm starting out on a new world. The uh, seed for this world is called Smilebox, capital S. Uh, I found it over in the Minecraft forums. It's uh, pretty much a standard Minecraft world, all in all. There's nothing extremely special, but it's got a, uh, a lot of high cliffs, caverns, overhangs, floating island. You know, the really interesting mountain features you kind of see a lot of times in a Minecraft world. And uh, they're, they're a little more abundant, at least they are around the spawn. I haven't really explored very far out yet on this uh, seed, but hopefully it maintains. See, there's some in the distance. Interesting. Um, this is, uh, I chose this seed because it's the seed that's going to be used on a, uh, a private server a friend of mine's making for uh, me and some of my buddies. Uh, the admin asked that I uh, work on making these videos, uh, specifically Let's Plays, so that I could sort of chronolog my progress as well as the progress of the other players uh, during the course of our um, server builds, ventures, whatever you want to call it. I mean, you know, mostly it'll be a vanilla server, so there's not anything too specific or special that'll be going on other than your traditional surviving, mining, building, Minecraft stuff. So, but uh, yeah, so here I am, starting out, uh, getting my wood. Uh, where you see me now, this is a little island, I f or I say island, it's a little nub of grassland atop, surrounded by water and sand and whatnot. But I uh, looked around a little bit and I chose this spot. Um, it seems like a decent enough area to start with. Uh, typically I like to pick mountains, like the top of mountains, side of mountains, natural caves and whatnot to um, actually set up my home. And I don't normally build right out in the open, especially on a survival map, just because there's a lot of distance between me and wherever I'm going this way. And that's just more space where I can run into the things that want to shoot me or blow up on me or, you know what I mean. But I figured I want a home that's a little visible out in the open that can be seen for whenever I uh, get around to being on the server. So I'll uh, record my X and Y's or X and Z's here and try to recreate it whenever the server gets going. So I'm just trying to clear out some land here and I'm going to set down a foundation. Well, not a real foundation, but a, a starting set up for a home anyways, and uh, go from there. Of course, your first day in Minecraft is always a race against time, as you've got to get your uh, base shelter done, and you are got to go find some coal or make some charcoal, which I've recently been doing. Uh, I've been taking quite a bit advantage of the, uh, the charcoal ability, simply because Let's face it, I'm, I'm just lazy, and it's so much easier just to chop down trees than it is to go wander around and look for coal. And, uh, yeah. Although, today I think I'll actually go look for some... There's... no? No. Man, stone seems so far away. Uh, I guess I'll go over there. Uh, yeah. Okay, so, I'll go look. This area seems decent enough. With any luck, I'll find... Hey, look, there's some coal right now. So, I got some coal. This will be good. I'm going to build away. Um, um, dang it. There we go. So, yeah. It's, it's only one piece. Marvelous. Alright. Let's get more stone and then. Right. No more coal here. Um, yay. Uh,. Oh, I see some in the distance. It's high noon. Okay. Let's see. And that looks reachable. I'm not really a uh, a big fan of Let's Plays. I'll be honest. I've watched very few. Generally, you just end up watching somebody dig all day, which is you know exactly what I'm doing. And it doesn't exactly strike me as the most entertaining thing. Uh, maybe that's because I'm just got too high a standard for videos nowadays. Uh, a lot of the uh, successful talents on YouTube have run me. So, uh, holes are odd. Um, yeah, it's just, you know, it's a world. It's a Minecraft world. Uh, with, I can't wait to actually be playing with other people instead of just 
doing the solo thing because to this point I've never actually engaged in server play at all in Minecraft. Even I've been a, uh, a player since the uh, early alpha days and the moment I got into it I just sort of, it was like, you know, I like building things. I mean, I was a Legos kid so it just sort of hits all the points of what I really want from a game. Only thing that's missing is, I guess, actual personal achievement. I mean, the only achievement you get is what you define for yourself. So I spent a lot of time just sort of coming up with crazy builds. Um, most of the things I've built in the history of my Minecraft games have always been... I've used a lot of hack tools and inventory editors so that I could just build non-stop, and I'd always play in peaceful. So I'm actually relatively new to survival in Minecraft simply because I haven't actually tried to survive a lot. Um, the earlier video I made was a uh, survival video. It was one of the first times I'd actually spent any length of time in a survival world. Um, typically I don't spend much time because I prefer to build. It's just not my nature to care. I mean, it's not like the mob AI is challenging or interesting. It's just there and more than not they just seem to be annoying than they are um, sort of they're more annoying than they are entertaining like you know when you're fighting you know first person shooters or okay I can't really think of anywhere where AI is entertaining it's always kind of annoying so let's just scrap that train of thought um, so Let's just see. Um, currently, grab more wood. I need to build a door and uh, get going here. Uh, I always build my doors on the north side of my homes um, or south side, but uh, for some reason, I just have this like weird. I guess it's a feng shui issue with east and west facing doors. I like my windows on the east and west so that I can get see the sunrise and the sunset, especially in Minecraft, just because the lighting is so tied to everything. And uh, you don't want to just, like, I don't know, if your windows are facing the other direction, you still see the lights. So I guess it doesn't really matter, but it's kind of the difference of seeing the sun. It's kind of like I like glass ceilings in my homes, too, occasionally, just so I can watch the progress across the sky. I suppose I should get around to actually uh, making a watch someday so I can see the progress of the uh, the sun, but that's a lot of effort. I'm lazy. <laughs> I'll admit it. Why put in the effort when you don't have to? All right. Time to work on the ceiling. And, 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 and go. There we go. All right. Block, 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 block. I hate dirt. Um, it's great for uh, scaffolding, but uh, it's you know I actually prefer the look of gravel more than I prefer the look of dirt. Um, I think it's the little brown, the brown, the little gray specks, specks of color that are actually in the brown block of dirt that bother me. It's you know the um, lack of uniformity you know every other block sort of maintains a uniform color spectrum uh, that's also why gravel is kind of dirty I guess and ugly looking it's because it's got such that mishmash of colors thrown in there but I get it it's supposed to be different rocks but for dirt the little gray speck just draws my eye every time and I can't escape it and it's so frustrating let's see up, up. Lots of wood, lots of wood. I'm gonna need it sooner or later. Do, 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 do. You know, I gotta admit, the, um, I was so pleased when Notch finally f worked out the issues with the leaf decay. Um, I still wish you could, like, chop a tree down and just, like, have the whole thing fall and turn into, like, little bricks to pick up. That'd be cool. But, uh, I don't think that's gonna ever happen. <laughs> uh, I don't think gravity in general will ever truly get implemented. Imagine how much easier harvesting a tree would be if you just had to chop the very first piece down, the very first bottom piece down, and it just fell over and just, you know, blocks everywhere. It's like, yes, it's so much simpler. But at least now you don't have to go around, like, chopping down tons of leaves or burning them all off because the game doesn't want to get rid of them. That was really annoying. Especially when you had, like, a forest fire, and of course now this fire doesn't spread, that's not even as much of an issue anymore, but... It was still an annoying issue. These, those blocks would sit there forever and never disappear. Oh, it's getting dark. I better hurry up. Yeah. It's pretty simple. 
basic build. I'm not really trying to do anything exceptional right now. Just want to get my shelter done before nightfall, and then tomorrow I'll go out and I generally start looking for cows and uh, whatnot so that I can begin. Come here, wood, so that I can begin harvesting leather and stuff to make some armor with. Um, I don't typically go cave spelunking in adventure mode. Uh, I do it quite a bit, of course, on pe on the uh, peaceful mode because there's nothing to attack you. But far too often, I seem to go into caves on. Um, wait, I I got time. Let's go wait and wait. Yeah, I got time. Let's grab some sand real quick. Um, I typically don't like to go in the caves because I end up getting swarmed a lot and one or two mobs are no big deal but when there's a bunch of them I seem to have an issue fighting them off. Um, I guess you could call it a personal failing or it's just I'm not lead enough anymore. Growing old has really hampered my gaming skills. It's like when you go back to play Mega Man after years of not playing it and it just totally owns you. I don't know what it is about the, that game. But, uh, yeah, I just don't have the skills I had when I was a child. And, let's see, I do not have enough stone. Dig, 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 dig. Oh, come on, why is stone so far to get to? It's the only bad part about a dirt island is there's just like, how many far down do I have to go here? Come on, do, 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 dig. I'm sure I'll find some here in a minute. Speaking of Mega Man, I really want to play the uh, the new one that came out. I guess, oh my god, a year, two years ago now. I don't know. I don't keep track with updates. I haven't had a new console since the PS2, so all I uh, do are play PC games now. And unfortunately, I've got this crappy Dell machine that doesn't play hardly anything at all. Uh, at least not very well. Come on, no, oh, come on, really. Still no stone. Come on, stone. Any time now, and fall through the hole. No, okay. I swear to God, someday I'm just gonna like do one block and instant fall into lava right off the surface, just so the game can screw me. I can see it happening. And finally, okay, stone. I have my furnace going. I hate not having windows, uh, especially at night, just because you. Hear the sounds outside, all the groanings and the spiders and the whatnot. It just—it's so much. I don't know. I wouldn't say comforting, but it's definitely um, more reassuring to know that you've got um, you know, something you can see out, and that way you can also watch the time better than just the little holes in the door. It's just kind of off-putting sometimes, and. I should light that up. I don't know if mobs spawn directly under my feet. I don't know if they do that. I haven't really honestly read into the mob spawning procedures or techniques. I just know the darkness spawns them. Uh, for all I know, I could be totally just like off my rocker thinking they'll spawn right where I'm standing. But uh, I don't like to take any risk if I can avoid it. So, yeah, let's get more coal because I'm all out of coal or charcoal. And do, 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 waiting, burn faster. I mean, like, where's the nuclear microwave button? There we go. One more. Come on. I said nuke it. Put that bastard on high. And okay, there we go. All right. Uh, let's build some more torches. And oh, right. Sand. Glass. There we go. Alright, um, let's see. Alright, let's leave that for a moment and I'm going to need more wood. And let's see, I want some. St no, wait. There we go. Sticks. Lots of sticks. And let's build some. I need more. Some ladders. I typically like steps better just because it's a little more visually appealing to me, but uh, in this tight space, this home, I'll go with a ladder. Just because. Wait. 
right. Yeah, that's the spot. Yeah, opposite the door. That'll work. One there, one there, and ladder. Ladder, ladder, ladder. Okay. Now we can actually get down here to do stuff. Awesome. So this is no longer necessary. Bye bye. Wait. Oh, that wasn't needed. Oh well. Fill it in. Alright, now while that glass melts, I guess I'll just dig out a little more here, gather some more material. I'm pretty much just killing time waiting till morning now because there's not much to do at all until daylight comes. Without armor, I really don't even prefer to be out at night. I don't like to be out at night with armor, <laughs> but uh, I definitely don't like going out without it. It's just... Uh, I still don't even have a bow, I don't have arrows, I don't have, have a, I haven't even made a sword yet, have I? Um, stone, stone, stone. So yeah, I'll just clear out some material, wait in my windows, or my glass four windows. Windows XP? No. Um, <laughs> that might make the game too easy, or at least it would blue screen to death a little more often. If you're uh, curious about the music that's uh, playing in the background, I uh, picked it up from Jamindo. It's an artist called Alexander Fl Filipin? Filipov? I don't know. I'm really bad with foreign names. I have no idea how you say it. Uh, the links are in the description below. Uh, it's licensed under the Creative Commons uh, for distribution and derivative works. So. I'm assuming he doesn't mind at all if I use it for my YouTube video. Uh, I liked it. It's real. I don't know. I like guitars and the sounds they make, so it's uh, it works out well. I have no musical ability of my own. I would probably just play with my own music, but I was not gifted with that, unfortunately. So, nope. Just the uh, yay glass. Just the listening for me. Uh, let's see. That'll work. Right there. Right. Yeah. Way too picky. Let's start on the east side. West side. Um. Yeah. West. No. East. Door faces north. It's east. I swear I need a map just so I can tell. Whoa! Watch out. I really should have heard him before doing that. You punk. Ha ha ha. You would think a glass cube would break. But, uh, yeah. Eat it. Eat that glass! Stupid zombie punk. There we go. Alright, next side. And there we go. And Alright, windows in place. Oh, moon's almost down. Yep, there's the sunrise. Cool. So, not much longer. I can go out and hunt down my leather and hunt down my wool. And I like to make roofs out of wool if I can, just because it looks kind of cool. Uh, it's a good thing fire doesn't spread from a mob to the environment, or that'd be awful. Let's uh, make a sword to go kill with. And, alright. Well, looks like that'll be it. Bye. Enjoy the sun.